Hello and welcome to another lecture and from the series uh, Learn Graphic Design, Learn Adobe Illustrator and today in this video I'm going to tell you about the effect panel and in the effect I'm going to do the stylized thing. So the first thing I'm going to tell you is uh, if you write the name over here is uh, G-R-A-F-I-X-E-R-S and uh, if I resize it and I'll make the color to green and I just want some shadows under it so in the little Adobe Illustrator you can just go to effect and uh, this path uh, stylus option and the drop shadow menu so if you just turn on the preview you can just see there is some shadow under the name and uh, you can just increase or decrease the opacity or uh, the x offset you can just move it around and on the x axis uh, you can move it around on the y axis wherever you want and this blur option will make it uh, you can adjust this blurry option as well in according to your need so if uh, one thing just i just want to make sure that if you are using darker color from the 50 50 thing like uh, this is 50 this is 50 this is 50 and uh, now uh, you are just in the middle if you are going down increases the uh, or if you go going up so this is a lighter tone and this one is a darker tone in the darker tone you will have to use multiply and if you are in a lighter tone make sure to use screen that is much much better than that so if you have a lighter tone use screen if you have a light darker tone use multiply if I press ok and make one layer under this uh, in a dark color then you will be able to see the shadow the light shadow so one thing the another thing in uh, you can uh, just remove this appearance from here the next thing in the stylus option is feather if you apply feather and get a preview decrease this you can see you're just having a feather effect at the outer boundaries of anything so if you want something to get some fading effect from the outside you can use feather or you can use the blur option so i will describe all the blur option later uh, this effect is also over here so i will remove the eye and we'll move to the next option that is in the glow so click this one and get a preview you can just i'll zoom this one Go to effect, stylize, and inner glow. Preview. You can see the uh, lights on the edges. You can have any color, and you can turn it to the center. So this one is as well a good good thing. Uh, you can increase or decrease the size or opacity. And again, if you are using a uh, lighter tone use the screen if you're going to darker one use the multiply and this will give you the results another thing in the effect panel and the stylize is outer glow preview this is outer glow the shadow and the outer glow is different because the outer outer glow will uh, give you the shadow on all of the sides while the shadow will give you the option uh, the shadow on the one side so the outer glow works better than the shadow most of the time the next thing is uh, a re uh, round corners preview one and get the corners round for your font this is a good option if you want to make changes to the corners and the next option is very very interesting it's scribble so this is kind of making something with the lines you can always change the uh, directions angles uh, path overlaps will keep it zero variations to zero 
if you uh, get this variation this will make it more uh, unreadable so the stroke rate is 3 you can decrease it and the curveness is 5 you can increase it or decrease it increasing it will make uh, more good effects the variation is 1 you can keep it to 0 the spacing is 5 you can decrease the spacing increase the spacing and variations is 5 you can decrease it to 0 so this is one scribble thing and you can just childish you can just some presets over here as well so this one is good again you can just undo this from here so this was about the effect and uh, now the next thing is arc upper and arc lower and other about these things i'll make a video for this as well thank you very much for watching up to now i think you got some good uh, grip on the double illustrator make sure to like and subscribe the channel and uh, comment uh, if you need any question or if you have any question or if you need any answers to it thank you very much thank you very much for watching have a good day bye bye